How's it going guys? Got myself some bubble wrap, but it must mean that I got something new. We'll check out what it is. So here it is. Got myself a snorkel from Outback Equipment Australia. Um, it's a tough terrain brand. Pretty much the same as a safari, except a lot cheaper. So I got this for 113 bucks. Um, it's a local company, so it was shipped out in three days. So pretty happy with that. Um, before we turn to this though, I'll have to get myself some new drill bits because the ones I have suck and I'll need a uh, 95mm hole saw for that one. So first time drilling into the fenders, not real keen about that, but um, it's alright, we'll send it, should be good. Alright, we'll see you down there. Alright, so I got everything I'm going to need, bought some drill bits, got a filer, got the uh, arbor for the hole saw, masking tape, drill, all the ratchets and everything, tighten everything up. But before we do that, got one hungry puppy over here and I'm hungry too, so we're going to eat and then um, yeah, we'll get into it. I've actually figured out how to open the damn thing. So we've been trading Ranger to stay. Thought I'd show you. Before anyone asks, we only feed Ranger during the day because he's on a different diet to what Roots is. Yes, I know. Alright. Oh, you ready? Ready? Stay. 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 He's alright. You watch, he'll finish that in like 10 seconds flat. So my plan of attack is to take the fender lining off first. So I didn't have great success with um, getting the fender lining off, but I've had enough off that I can get my hand up there. So now just gonna masking tape up the fender so that way I can draw straight onto it. Template all taped on, got masking tape underneath just to protect it again. Not really sure, I'm gonna need to take this fender on and off completely, so I'm gonna search up a video on how to do that because this one is not budging. But um, yeah, then I'll just be able to drill all the holes out and then um, Bob's your auntie, I guess. I think I'll just have to take the fender off first. So I've almost got my fender off, let's hope I don't break any clips. fender liner almost completely off there's one clip in still but it's not budging and I don't want to snap it but I've got enough room to do everything here there's so much crap in here though and look at this pull this back there's literally just a heap of soil there what the hell All right. <laughs> Check that out. It's 
it's all over mum's driveway now. <laughs> So I figured out quick smart that I should be drilling a pilot holes before I drilled the actual size. So I did that first and then drilled all them out, got a pilot hole here. We're ready to put this big dog through it. So um, yeah, hopefully all goes well. She cuts her off. <laughs> Now I'll just be able to get the pipes on. Charge. I just pulled this out, out, so there's two bolts up here, and then two little things that sit in the bushes there. And there's a rivet that goes through the bottom of this thing, and you get a replacement one with the kit, which is metal. Get that out, so that bit comes out. Got this one. So the little cutout bit goes to the right there. Oh, it must go over the top. <laughs> Finally got that air box back in with that new pipe on there. It was a bit tough, you can see through there, it's poking out. Now, pretty much all I have to do, chuck this little one over, which then connects onto the snorkel. Bolt all the snorkel up. I gotta do the top mounting point there, but I'll probably mount it up. I'm gonna do something cool real quick, ready? Three, two, one. And just like that, it's ready for a snorkel, mate. Bit decent job if I do say so myself on my first ever go. So I just noticed that there's these little studs that come with it. So these just thread into these bad boys before you put it on. I'll thread all of these on and then chuck it on so I can get that other plate. <laughs> Those are all on. Um, just hand tighten them up with the nailing key. Don't want to over tighten these bad boys. Yeah, we'll chuck them on and hopefully all the holes line up. Otherwise, I've done something wrong. Moment of truth. These are on a bit of an angle. They look quite lining up. It's all right. The snorkel is finally on. Took me a lot of filing and drilling out more, and but it's on. Um, there's a bit of a gap there, and that top plate isn't on yet because you need rib nuts for it, and we don't have a gun to put the rib nuts in. But I'll do that another time. For now, pretty mint. Um, just got to tighten up all the nuts on the back of this, and then put the fender lining in and everything, and the fender back on, and then we'll be. <laughs> It's all mounted up now, tightened up, looking pretty flush there, pretty nice. Just got to put the hose clamp on the top, give her a start and make sure that it's all good. And I'll send in a clean out under there because that is disgusting with all that mud and everything that was in there. All right, all cleaned up, all that stuff's come out. Looks nice and clean now. Give it a start, make sure there's no leaks or anything in it. Mint. Now she's got the good uh, sucky sucky through there. Video. Yeah, look, I was gonna film it. I think you've seen enough of me taking the fender on and off today, so we'll just do this. Like I bought one, guys. All back together. Looks pretty mint. Yeah, keen to test it out on tracks, eh? All right, that'll do for today's video. The snorkel's all on now. Looks sick. Hopefully works good. Keen to um, actually use it. Yeah, not too hard of an install. Obviously, if you've got another person and actually already have the tools, you don't have to get it yourself, then it'll be a lot easier. That was a bit of the time just getting it. 
good product, I'd say. Only thing I'd say is that if you're gonna do one yourself, link will be in the description, by the way. Then drill out the holes to nine and a half mil instead of eight and a half mil because some of, the, some of the studs will go like down and some will go across. It was a bit hard to line up, probably took me like an hour of filing to get it all to line up, but I reckon if you just drilled them that size from the start, then you'd have it done quick. If there's anything I missed or any questions you got, chuck them in the comments down below. As always, if you like the video, give us a like and a subscribe, and uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Cheers guys, see ya.